for those of you who like the uh, SKS rifle. Uh, we got one here. It's been on some of my other videos, but this is a better quality video. We've got a better camera now. Um, it's the same old SKS Norinco, Chinese made, um, with a ramline stock. I don't like it very much, but it serves its purpose. And uh, if you don't, if you're wondering why, it'll be on one of my previous videos. We've got plastic Tapco mags. Uh, 20 rounder pin to 5 rounds because I'm in Canada. Um, really nice looking mags. Um, it's a good rifle. It's just really fun for planking. Like, it is the best planking rifle. The ammo is more expensive than, say, a 22 or whatever, but still very cheap. You can get approximately, was it, 1,000 rounds. 1,120 rounds of ammunition for about 200 bucks. Surplus ammunition. It's corrosive, so you have to clean your rifle really well every time. But, uh, other than that, it's great. But, uh, let's get down to some shooting, shall we? Too bad this stock doesn't fold. It looks like it should, but it doesn't, unfortunately. And, uh, yeah, it's a great rifle. Really fun. A little heavy, but it's basically the predecessor to the AK-47, so you'd expect that. Russian rifles are nice and heavy and durable. I like heavy and durable. I mean, it's not going to break on me. But, uh, yeah, um... I guess I'll do one more round of shooting for you guys. Just the rest of the stripper clip up. Jeez. What happens once in a while? It gets all jammed up on you. It's not the gun, it's just me. The horrible, horrible loader. I haven't been shooting in a while, so. Nice ego shooting though. That can run off too. That's the SKS rifle. Fun to shoot. Great reliability, probably, probably just as reliable as AK-47. I would do a reliability test, but I prefer my gun not to blow up because I'm too poor to buy another one. Um, yeah. so that's that. Uh, nice day shooting out here today. If you're wondering what I was shooting at, the whole time because I don't think I showed it. This little tin can up here somewhere. I'm not really sure where it ran off to. The go or go. I shoot on government land, so so gotta pick up after yourself. I'll have to go pick up my casings and whatnot. But I'm honestly unsure where it went. Oh, there it is. That's holes from probably the probably the Henry 22 I just showed there. And then I'm assuming that big gash is from the SKS. But, uh, always fun to have a can to shoot at. I'm sure it'll still, it'll still recycle it. Um, yeah. Anyways, another beautiful day in Kananaskis country. Josh Hope.